that I shared there with Larissa. Never, I'll never forget. Never forget it. I fell in love in center field at Fenway Park. After Fenway, we went across the street to a bar, and all of a sudden, there's this group of guys, and they start applauding as we're walking in. And it turns out that they were four of Brian's closest friends. We had a great day. And I'm sure Brian's a better storyteller than I am. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> when they walked in the room, I was like overtaken by her. I was like, that is crazy. That is unbelievable. Brian and I go out all the time, and that was beautiful. She is gorgeous. It wasn't Brian walking through that door. It was Brian and Larissa. And that, from that first date, did you have a connection with Brian, you think? Oh, or? absolutely. Really? Absolutely. That's why I'm here with him right now. I think they could see by the way I walked in with her that I'm just thrilled to death to be with this girl. That's new for them. You know, they haven't seen that side of me with a girl. Whatever may happen, I just wish you guys the best, really. You know? Cheers again. I just want another drink. <laughs> I was very proud to be in love you know, with Larissa and one of my friends. I liked kissing her in front of them. I, I want them to, to know that she's a keeper. This is, I think that this is the one. Larissa and I took a limo down to the Boston Harbor Hotel. This is down on the waterfront, about 100 yards from where I work. Oh my gosh, wow. Look at this. It was gorgeous. The pavilion was decorated by spruce floral. Thank you. You're welcome. Tonight was very romantic. You know, I've been on other dates with, with the other guys, obviously eating dinner in beautiful settings, but there was something about the energy tonight that was different. Today just went exactly the way I dreamed it could go, and it did, and I'm just, I'm thrilled. I'm, act I'm so thrilled. I wish, I wish we had more time here. There's so much. I'm gonna to take today and, and never, ever forget it. It was a very powerful moment when we kissed because it was different than any of the other kisses I've had with Brian. The other times I held back a little bit, but I found that just tonight, he knew what he was doing. He knew what he wanted this time. Learned a lot, you know, from this trip. And, you know, it's all because of you. You've taught me a lot, including I wanted to, to tell her. I wanted to say, you know, say the three words that I've never said before. You know, all these emotions that I've had inside. Love is one of them. But I'll save uh, a few words for a, uh, a private moment. I'd like to say something in private. She had a reaction because she has very strong feelings for me. To hear him say those words or want to say that and express that to me, just the fact that he has so much emotion and that he's never felt that way about anybody. And to tell that to me just, it makes me feel amazing. Actually, I'm very proud of myself for opening up and, and all the things that I did in the, uh, you know, for Christ's sakes, you know, I'm 31, and I need, I need love. I need to be in a relationship with love. I know I love Larissa, and, you know, it's just, it's, it's just time for me to do this.
has all led to this. Larissa has made up her mind, but she still has one secret left to reveal. I do have something in my past. Two guys. I don't think there's a comparison. The smart decision will be me. I am nervous about this. I really would like to get picked. One flies away with her tonight. The other has a seat on the bus ride home. The dramatic final elimination is next. This is it. The two guys on their way here are both amazing. I am nervous about this. I never in a million years thought I would be in this situation, feeling the way that I do. I, I really would like to get picked. I really, really would. I'm the last of the old guys, and I want to show the world that the average regular guy can get the girl. The decision to choose one is not an easy choice because they have different qualities. On one hand, you want to be physically attracted to somebody, you want to have that passion. Being in a relationship with Larissa would make my life better because what I'm looking for is true happiness. And when I'm with her, I'm happy. But you also want to have somebody that has depth and has a great personality and has a big heart. My life, you know, so far, I think has been like a masterpiece, but in black and white. So finally I've fallen in love. It's, you know, almost like I've been colorblind, and then all of a sudden I've been able to see color, you know, through this experience because of Larissa. Standing here waiting for the guys to arrive is the hardest thing that I've had to do so far. I completely dread making this final decision because it's not going to be easy. If I'm not picked, it's going to be Nothing but heartbreak. I would feel, you know, extremely let down. This is a very, uh, very lonely drive right now. Um, yeah, I feel very isolated. It's the end of the road, and I'm really kind of looking forward to seeing exactly what Larissa is thinking. It's almost on the, the level of uh, bleeding Elsa, but uh, um, I'm thinking positive thoughts. I'm ready for it. I'm ready. I'm ready for a decision. so torn and hurting one of these guys is going to completely tear me apart. feelings for you. Strong feelings. But sometimes I question whether you're ready to take it to the next level. So I hope you understand that there's only one thing I can do. And that's to trust my instinct. And my instinct tells me that you're the one for me. And I want you to fly away with me tonight. And I want to see if we can make this fantasy a reality. <laughs> trusting your instincts. You're right. This has been a long, long trip. It's a long process trying to get to know her and her doing the same for me. So for us to finally make it to the end of the road together was, uh, you know, it was, it was it was a great feeling. I don't I don't know what to say. I'm so happy. I was hoping that you would go with your instinct. I was hoping that you would trust, you know, what the connection that we had. And I'm so glad you did. <laughs> 